Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This hopefully will not be a confusing video because I'm a little confused myself. I think I like got too excited and let me backtrack and tell you guys the story. But first, welcome. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Uh, thank you for clicking. I hope you like what you see and if you do, please considering hitting that like button, that subscribe button so you guys can continue watching my channel and my uh, growth to saving. Because it's an attempt. It's an attempt. Um, and if you're a returning subscriber, you already know. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. This month is my happy month. Magic month. Okay. Um, so that means I'm going to get three paychecks this month. And I got really excited. And I think I got too excited. And kind of my chickens a little too early before they hatched why you may ask for starters let's go bring it back a little bit more currently i'm in a job where i'm not very happy i make good money but i'm not happy um so i'm in process of interviewing and i have an interview tomorrow and it's gonna be my third interview for this job and i'm excited about it but i'm kind of not excited about it at the same time i'm excited about it because it's a big organization it's going to be under a hospital if i get it which is exciting the only thing i'm not excited about is if i do get it it will be a pay cut um nothing crazy but it will be a pay cut so to see what i'm talking about right now i'm getting paid how much am i getting paid 2164 times 26 weeks that's my income right now this job they're saying the highest they could pay me is 51 so let's do 51 so i will be getting five thousand dollars less that's if they pay me the max that they're allotted to pay me that divided by 52 weeks so i'll be getting 101 less in my pay um which isn't too crazy it doesn't sound crazy if if they're gonna be paying me the 51 I don't think I will take anything lower than that just that's just because I don't know I don't know <laughs> but other than that the benefits are great I mean it's under a hospital so the benefits are really really good I'll be getting like 27 days vacation seven days of sick and then say I get like COVID or um the flu god forbid that's a separate kind of sick so they'll be giving me an extra week of sick on top of that and not using my regular sick pay um and they said there's another type of sick and then there's like a 401k that they have but it's a different 401k they have a lot of benefits which is all screaming good stuff it's just the pay where I'm like e -e -e. so I don't know but I have my third interview tomorrow which is gonna be friday um so y'all wish me luck so with that being said i was going to give all my envelopes love but i feel like i need to focus more on my debt right now and also um my friend well our friend my fiance's friend and i is getting married we got invited to the wedding and the wedding is going to be in colombia and that wedding is happening February 2023. So that is where June don't even count. July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February. Eight months away. Right? Eight months away. And I'm pretty sure I only have $60 saved in my travel. <laughs> so I got nothing. So I need to pump that bad boy up because i mean we already said yes that we're gonna go and i really don't want to use my credit card and i think with the plan i have it's okay so with all that five minute explanation let's try to figure this out um i did like i wrote out this budget thing like so many times to try to figure it out and i think i finally chose one and I'm just going to stick to it. And I mean, I can't, I'm not going to give my envelopes all the love that they need. But it's fine because I really need to pay off this debt. And I need to really pay, put money away for the trap, for the trip. That is the number two goal. First one is my debt. 
so i had already used some money before i even started budgeting so that is why it's going to be less money right now it's really technically i'm only budgeting for one week rather than my two weeks uh so let's just start with 1250 is the magic number we're gonna be working with today i feel like i'm really close okay i think that's better i really hope i get the job and i really hope they at least give me 51 i'm really hoping they at least give me 51 but i'm not gonna think about that anymore because y'all that's been stressing me out I think about it. I think about it. And then tomorrow we also have a wedding, so that's exciting. And that also meant that I had to go buy dresses, and that was such a mess. That was such a hot mess because your girl gained weight, and I just have not come to terms with that. And it was just a mess. But thankfully, Amazon came through, and I found some really cute dresses on Amazon, surprisingly. So I think I found my dress, and I'm ready for tomorrow. Like, I think I found. Do y'all hear me? I think I found my dress for a wedding for tomorrow. Like, what? Girl, you should have been had your dress, like, way before, but... <sighs> Craziness. And I've been saying I wanted to do this video, but I've just been stalling because I really just don't want to even look at it or think about it because I'm kind of upset that I won't be giving my envelopes the love that I've been wanting to give them. But I just have to remind myself that it's my journey and it's okay because I just see other channels doing, like, all these other stuff things. I'm like, oh, I wish I could do it. And then I push myself too much to the point where I'm like stressing myself out. So I need to take a step back and just do what I can. And I constantly have to remind myself to just do what I can. And that's it. Like I really, I want to even to do more of the 100 envelopes, but I can't. Like I just can't and I have to accept that. And it's really this debt. So I'm going to be paying down this debt. I already have a plan. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. Ma, don't kill me. <laughs> but... I have a plan. It's gonna work. We got this. I got this. We got this. Okay. So, 1250 is the magic number for this. We're gonna be paying Chase. We're gonna split this payment into two because I owe $42 in Chase. So, we're gonna be paying that. Um, Chase is because... Why is Chase? Chase is because of easy pass and easy pass is because we kept going to the city and y'all i never realized how much it tolls were like that was 40 dollars alone just i think in like two trips to the city like that's crazy that's crazy how why no reason to ever charge that much house contribution is going to be getting 100 because 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 it is a three paycheck month, I just split this into three so I can have a little more cash to do a specific stuff in. Uh, so house is gonna get 100. Lemonade, which is my cat's insurance, that's gonna be getting 18. The total insurance for the month is 36. So we're just gonna split that into two. Capital One, which is my credit card. I only have one, I'm only using one credit card. And then the other credit cards, just to keep them open and like show that I'm using it but not using it, I just link it to Netflix. Um, iTunes is linked to one of the credit cards. Uh, Lemonade is linked to one of the credit cards. And those I just make sure I pay off automatically. So at least it's showing that I use my card, but I'm also paying it off. Capital One is the only card that has a balance. And that is how I want to keep it. And I don't want to keep, I don't want to balance more than what I have right now. And I'll be showing you guys what I have. And after I do this, I'll show you guys um, the printout I did and the plan that I have. So Capital One is going to be getting $200. Uh, Acorns. I re-signed up for Acorns again. Um, I mean, the now and the later for Acorns. And each week, it takes $10 off my paycheck that's why i'm doing two because i get paid bi-weekly not two that's why i'm doing 20 because i get paid bi-weekly and it takes out ten dollars start is another loan that i have and that loan i took out three years ago to pay off all of my credit cards because i was in a whole lot of debt and i will be showing you guys that too in a little bit um but upstart is going to be getting 209 my payment for upstart is actually 417 but because i 
once again, I'm getting three paychecks. I decided that I'm going to be splitting Upstart into two. So then it won't be so high for me and I could do other stuff with it. So up, that is going to get 209 wedding gift. I'm going to share what that is. Yeah, we won't share what that is. Um, food is going to be getting 300 car is getting 60 pet food is going to be getting 25 these are for my envelopes travel is going to be getting 150 Pet emergency, I finally get to show this little bad boy some love and I need to stop ignoring it because it came through the last time and I feel like I just need it. Um, so I'm gonna stuff even if it's $5 just to help it grow because it will add up eventually. But pet emergency is gonna get 10. Christmas is one that's super important to me and that is one I will not let go along with birthdays. That one's really important to me as well. I might lower how much each person is going to be getting or allotted for for Christmas, but we'll see. I don't want to get too ahead of myself. Um, and then 100 envelope. I actually did 100 envelope. 100 envelope. And for that, I put $20 away. With all that is going to give me with negative three, but that's fine because I have a buffer in my bank account and that's going to cover that. It's okay. I am okay with that. So this is what I will be stuffing for the week. Um, car, I already took out the money. Food, I got to take out the money. Capital One, I already did the payment, so that's fine. But yeah, this is it. This is my budget for... What is this? June paycheck number one. June paycheck number one. I guess I could say week two because we're already on June 9th and I got paid June 2nd. That's how delayed I am, y'all. I normally do a budget with me the day before I get paid because I know how much I get paid since I'm salary. But it's been so stressful. But it's okay. This is my budget. It is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm sorry I'm not like all happy preppy. Boom, boom, boom. But I'm a little stressed out, y'all. I'm a little stressed out. I think I'm just nervous. But everything will be okay. If it's meant for me, it's meant for me. I just gotta keep telling myself that. But yeah, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. No, that is not it. I said I was gonna show you guys my debt plan. So I'll show you one because I have to do the math for the other one. But this is my debt plan for my Capital One card. This is how much debt I am in right now. And you guys may ask Cynthia, what the heck happened? Uh, no. I started out with 300 I paid that off. And then, y'all, it's the free. It's food. It's food. Food is taking my money. At least, like, it's food. Can't be upset. It's food. I'm feeding myself, and I'm happy, and boom. But the issue is, I'll put it on my card, and everybody will be like, oh, I'll give you cash. They give me the cash, but then I never pay it back, and I just keep it. I'm like, all right, well, I could just use this cash for the rest of the food, and then I'll pay myself back. And I keep saying, I'll pay myself back, I pay myself back, I pay myself back, and now I'm at a 1000 I'm like, er, that's it. I put my, my credit card away. I hit it so I don't use it anymore. So that's that. We're going to be paying this down. Um, each of these squares, y'all, I spent, <laughs> I counted each square. And once I got to the top, I was like, boom, 100. When I look in the bottom, it says there are 100 squares. Like what? I just counted it for nothing. But the, the reading is fundamental, y'all. Reading is important. So, yeah. We're going to be doing this fun little coloring thing every time I make a payment. And then I got this for free at uh, Debt Free Charts. I Googled it while I was working very hard. <laughs> Now that is it. Um, for my other debt, I'll show you guys another time. I got this printout, but I just have to figure out how much the total for Upstart is the name of the loan that I took. I just have to figure out how much debt that is, and then I could color this in. And that's why I got a whole bunch of little squares because that one is a lot of debt. 
uh, which is why the payment is 400 something dollars a month. <laughs> um, I have to figure that out and then I'll show you guys once I do and every single time I make a payment, we'll do the fun coloring in. So at least it's, you know, a little fun every time I pay my debt. And yeah, that is it. Thankfully, we're in a three check month. So then at least I could work on paying this debt down and then hopefully when I get the job with the pay that I want, I won't be having to owe so much money on my credit card. That is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. My next video is going to be my cash stuffing, my little cash stuffing for all the money that I have left. That is it. Thank you all for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.